One, two, three. <laughs> okay. I know this notification was a jump scare for some of you. <laughs> so hey, what is up guys? It's Z again and welcome back to Fire Emblem Three Houses! There's like <laughs> there's a hair in my mouth, Scott. <laughs> For you guys who don't know, I have a Discord that you can join via the description below. And in my Discords, I occasionally, not always, I occasionally hold polls of what this week's uploads should be. And for the first time in a very long time, uh, Fire Emblem won the poll. So here we are. Good to see you guys are still alive. And it's going to be a great return episode because we're fighting the Pirates of the North! It's in the north. I got a little excited. I love pirates a lot, guys. I don't know if you know this about me. I feel like you should. I love pirates a lot. I love the sea. I am the designated pirate friend. You may call me captain, and I will turn around. I will respond. For this is me, and I am captain. Okay? I love pirates. Passionately. Thank you. <laughs> but about a sand. I hate sand. It gets everywhere. It gets everywhere. It's so annoying. I don't like sand. Um, let's check our inventory real quick, guys, real quick. I remember how to play the game. Good. Ooh, Lance of Ruin needs some help. Help me. Okay. Let's get her done. What's my strategy? Oh, uh, your strategy is to kill things expeditiously, one might say. With a crit. This chick's crazy. Woo! Another victim. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Another crit! I can attack. What am I attacking? Ooh, I only got one more of those in my inventory though. I think I think we're just gonna rally. I aim for greatness. 35% chance of hitting and still hitting is kinda nutty, no? <laughs> What am I attacking? Oh, there's a guy in the bushes! I will not die here. Oh, is he dying? Because of this guy? He'll hit first. Oh. You knew the odds. I did. I did the math. <gasps> Special event happening on the 26th. Look it's at this almost mean. time to depart. Are you ready? Yes. A promising answer. Whatever happens, never allow your foe to see any weakness. I promise. We must pay close attention not only to Claude's schemes, but to the man himself. He's mm. a master archer who wields the legendary bow, Fail Not. He won't fall easily. It's the relic of House Regan. That bow once belonged to one of the ten elites. Professor, do you know the true story behind the legend? Nope. The relics were created by the hands of mankind. Saros collected them after killing the ten elites. Saros manipulated the people of the world and defeated the all-powerful King Nemesis. The church maintains the false history that he was corrupted and turned evil, However, it was little more than a simple dispute. Should the one leading the people of the world be someone with humanity, or a creature that can merely masquerade as a human at will? In the end, Saros was victorious. The Immaculate One and her family then took control of Fodlan. I know this because that knowledge is passed down from emperor to emperor. And that is because the first emperor is the human who cooperated with Saros, allowing humanity to be controlled in secret. See. Perhaps it's fate that you can wield the sword of the creator, just like Nemesis, the king of liberation. And that very fate will lead you to use that sword to stand against those who would distort history. That's heavy. That's heavy. I will do my best. Another thing. It's every day or something else, man. It seems they've set out oh. from Garrick Mach. That's sooner than expected. Losing the Great Bridge of Murden was a serious blow. 
So is the fact that Teach is still alive. Hey, what's On up? On top of all that, Judith. I told her to run if things look grim. Damn it. So many people will die, and by my call. And what of it? Would you rather turn tail and run back home? Nadir, you're really getting on my nerves. Do you have any idea how much of the Alliance adores me and believes in me? Well, I suppose it's quite a lot. Does that mean that... Yes, the plan is a go. I'm counting on you, Nadir. We'll make a good show taking down those who would assault Deirdre. <laughs> People say our kind may not always win, but we never lose. Let's teach them the real meaning of those words. Now then, let's see what you're made of, Teach. Um, amazing things, apparently. I have d avoided death. <laughs> How's the God? All this stuff, man. All this, all this good, great, good, 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 and good. <laughs> wow. Thanks. I'm glad I asked you. Yeah, see, that's what we did. My bad, guys. But we got blue cheese. W. Okay. Here we go. All those battles led to this moment right now thank you okay guys win a bowl let's check out this map this is serious town this is serious biz enough okay oh i kind of wanted her on my team what is what does fire emblem always make you do that and it's like hey these characters that you got to know and stuff kill them why does it do that why does nintendo do that why does the Fire Emblem teams do that? <sighs> we might want to put this guy over here. It's because he's going to have more movement range, and getting him up is not going to be as difficult. Casper's mm, movement range is horrendously small, and I will never know why. Now it's our turn, Almira's Elite. Strike the flanks of the Imperial Army. Well, that's not nice. Those fangs and claws the Alliance fears so much will now be their salvation. Leave it to us, kiddo. My undefeated streak will live on. Another chapter in my- That flag and banner. Is that the Almiran army? Ugh, you really did it, Claude. This is no ruse. That is Nadir, an Almiran general. Take care of them quickly. Especially those Almiran wyverns. You are here as well, Professor? That is a shame. <laughs> Forgive me. My... I just got set. Like, hilariously set. Like, I was just told to take a seat, and I had no choice but to do exactly that. That is insane. I hope this works. Oh my god, I hope this works. Awesome. That's the last of my energy. If you're gonna kill me, make it quick. Fair warning, though, I'll likely come back to haunt you. It's not... You want me to join you? Yes, please. The alliance is over no matter what. The only thing left is to place faith in you and yes! everyone. There's still so much I have to accomplish. Thank you for the second chance, Professor. Dario! She's ours now, bucko. <laughs> I need... Oh, I need him at the back, actually. The Almiran reinforcements keep coming. We should try to eliminate Nadir. Everyone is so squishy. What am I to do? I cannot die here. Come on. Oh, we're down two. Oh, we're down two. You didn't. 
Ooh, my bad. I didn't mean to skip her. It's been fun, Claude. <sighs> Sorry to go. Oh, we don't even get the choice to recruit her. Hilda! That's different. Why didn't you retreat? I counted on you retreating. Unfortunate, really. Um, anyways. This over lance is gonna break. Yeah. This is such a gamble, because if he hits me on my turn, and it's more than 23, I die. But if it's 23 again, I will have 1 HP. <laughs> and will win that. That's such a gamble. This is such a gamble. Unless he doesn't follow? He doesn't follow. Okay, that's good. That is, uh, very good. Oh, it the likelihood of him striking Onward. me is also super low, apparently. My bad. I'm still not over how I got one shot, like, off the get-go. I got set the f down, brother. My duty yes! Is yes! <laughs> I'm sorry. That came from, like, deep in my soul. Deep, deep in my soul. We don't have the guts to resist anymore. Here, you can have this. Just please don't attack the city. I never planned to touch the city. Our target is the alliance. Kill work death. <laughs> oh, it missed, didn't it? Ooh, not good. Not good, my friends. Sorry, kiddo. It seems we'll have to withdraw. Dorothy, you're coming in clutch. We haven't seen each other since Garrick Mach. You've grown lovelier than ever, Edelgard. You're not so unfortunate yourself. And so as usual, you're here at a most inopportune moment. Well, I'm sure we have much to talk about. But how about we settle things first? No objections here. Prepare yourself, Claude. That's so cute. Like she's gonna let you live. That's no. horrible. Hold the grudge if you must. No! Done all I can. I Yo, that might have been my fault, guys. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna lie to you. That may have been my fault. I may have done a little bit of a jinxing there. It's okay, though. Watch this. I didn't even see what he says. <laughs> my bad! The plan's not working. The fate of the Lester Alliance. All of my dreams have fallen to ash. It's all up to you now, Edelgard. I hope you really do make the world better. We will. Everybody, raise your voices in a victory cheer. Deirdre is ours. A crit on Adol was wild. Also, absolutely sitting down Kiplin was wild. Thank you so much. All of it was wild. <laughs> Deirdre is ours. The alliance has collapsed and their leader has fallen. If Claude had lived, the faction of the Alliance that is against the Empire would never have stopped fighting us. To keep the bloodshed to a minimum, he had to be taken out of the equation. However, now that it's over, I can't help but wonder if he was in complete control of that entire situation. What will become of the Alliance without him? He must have taken that into account. Without the rule of House Regan, and with most of that territory left unscathed, the Alliance will undoubtedly ally itself with the Empire. The citizens' lives will be saved from ruin, and no more blood will be shed. Perhaps that's what he wanted from the start. Rule. Of course, if his plan here in Deirdre had worked and I had lost my life, the opposite would have come to pass. The Empire would have rushed to the Alliance without further conflict. No matter how the battle unfolded, Claude secured the shortest, most peaceful outcome possible. Lady Edelgard, 
Deirdre is now completely under our control. As planned, the Alliance's affairs will now be overseen by Count Burglis. My father is coming here? First west, then east. You sure keep him busy. <laughs> Should the others return to the monastery and prepare to face the kingdom? Yes, thank you, Hubert. Thanks to all of your efforts, our battle with the Alliance has reached its conclusion. However, we still can't afford to be careless. We must now join the battle against the kingdom. With the strength of the church on their side, they will prove to be a formidable enemy. More than ever, your support is invaluable. We'll need it in the days to come. But for now, let's enjoy our triumphant return. Let's get to it! I'm so happy that the end of the fighting is near. Too bad there's still more violence to come. The kingdom and the Church of Saros are worthy for fighting. I will crush them into very small pieces. Crushing <laughs> wouldn't yield a lot of pieces, but I guess it would get the job done. With the professor, we can't lose. Probably. Oh, no. I, I mean, I got sat I'm like first Lady round Rhea. in, guys. Let's. But she's scary, and she'll be really angry. But no way she can stay in her spooky beast form all the time, right? If she could, she would have come and attacked the monastery as many times as she wanted. It may be wishful thinking, but perhaps it is a power that she can only access when the situation is dire. But whether she is the Archbishop or the Immaculate One, we cannot be stopped. Half remains, but half is finished. We are certainly moving forward. <laughs> Love the optimism. No one can stop us from pushing forward. No one. With Deirdre under Imperial control, the Leicester Alliance ceases to exist, and its remaining lords ally themselves with the Empire. The Black Eagle Strike Force, having now conquered all of Eastern Fodlan, confidently moves to invade the kingdom. And that concludes Count Burgley's report. Just as your majesty predicted, the old alliance has willingly fallen under imperial rule. However, even with Claude dead, there is no telling what manner of poison he left in his wake. We must be careful not to expose any weakness. Of course, though it seems we can now attack the kingdom without issue. True. That's what it means. However, you should know that Lord Arendelle has entered Deirdre. It would seem he has already started collecting the relics of the old alliance. Let him do as he pleases for now. It's not yet the time to chide him. Understood. As for the kingdom, as we theorized, it is not entirely united. If we defeat the royal family of House Blathed, and a handful of other notable houses, it should fall under our control quite readily. Those we must target include the houses Fraldarius, Galatea, Gautier, and Karen. We have allies Gautier. who are close to some of those lords. Perhaps that can be used to our advantage. Persuasion by tears or threats. Perhaps one would consent to act as a hostage. We must make good use of the tools given to us. What about House Roe in Aryan Roe, the fortress city? Will they not side with us? The head of House Fraldarius, Lord Rodrigue, has entered the city. It is possible that he has seized it. I see. Then it might prove too difficult to strike Ferdiad right away. Either way, when preparations are complete, we can begin our deployment into the kingdom. That part of the plan remains unchanged. Professor, is something wrong? No. Yeah, no, I recognize Gaudier, and that was it. <laughs> yes, I don't imagine that you have much interest in a running list of noble names. But it matters not. The nobility right. and the weight of all those names I will don't. be gone once the war is over. <sighs> this month, we must again put all of our effort into preparing for battle. I'm counting on you, my teacher. Hello? Ah! Hey, can you go check us the He was outside last time I checked. Professor, you didn't hear anything just now, did you? <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure I did, actually. You 
boot. Huh. Well, be that as it may, it is not your concern. It was nothing. <laughs> I told you it was nothing, and I meant it. It's just... Uh, well, there was a rat. I don't enjoy <laughs> the company of rats. Rats are cool! <laughs> I believe I've told you about this before. About when I was held captive beneath the palace. There were a lot of rats there. To this day, I just... What? <laughs> oh, Professor, leave here at once. I recall now that Hubert needs to speak with me. I must change my clothes. Now, whatever you do, don't look this way. Ah, uh, then forget what you saw. That's an order. <laughs> an order? Crazy, really. I'm not even entirely sure what I saw. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. And if you really like my content, hit the notification bell so that every time I upload, you know about it. Join the Discord if you want to participate in the polls that occasionally decide what I will upload for the week. Otherwise, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.